Hi, YouTube. It's been a while. Actually, it hasn't been a while. No, Dicky, I was p dicking about. <laughs> hey, Lord Yoshi. This is Outlast, YouTube. For me, it's been a while. It's been three days since the last stream. For you guys, it's not been any time at all because I spaced out that time with a previously recorded session of uh, Armored Core, which I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, people have been really enjoying Wolfenstein, which I'm really pleased about. It means we can play the second one after we're done with Outlast. I've never played Outlast. When the game first released, I think I watched Markiplier play it. I don't remember anything about this game except there's a big fat guy and there's lots of willies. So if you are uh, under 18, please click away now. I'll have this marked as 18 plus on YouTube anyway, but I know people use their parents' accounts. Just be aware of that, so. Uh, this is a horror game. We'll play it hard. Well, here we go then. <clears throat> Outlast contains intense violence, gore, graphic sexual content, and strong language. Please enjoy. You're Miles Upshore, an investigative reporter whose ambition is about to earn him an intimate tour of hell on Earth. Always willing to risk digging into stories no other journalist would dare investigate, you will seek out the dark secrets at the heart of Mount Massive Asylum. Stay alive as long as you can, record everything, you're not a fighter. To navigate the horrors of Mount Massive, suppose the truth, your only choice is to run, hide, or die. Sapien Salt, the high stress day was yesterday. Today's a recovery day. Tomorrow is a reset. So it's all good. It's all good. Don't worry. Echoes need to sneak out. Okay. Immediately, my sensitivity is that of a mongoose on crack. Let me know how the volume is, chat. Thank you very much for the gift sub, by the way, Ava Orca. It's very kind of you. And it's always lovely to see Commander General Havoc. It's been a hot minute. 1440p. Intense. Again and again. Think figure it out. To bring this song to its end. All right. Yeah, it's been a hot minute, dude. What do you do these days? Stop giving our crack to the mongoose. But it's so funny watching them explode. Can I grab my press badge? It's bound to keep me safe, right? Hell yeah, Darcy. From... 1026-011-0756 at MuteMail.com Tip, illegal activity at Murkoff Psychiatric Systems. You don't know me. I have to make this quick. They might be monitoring. I did two weeks of software consult at Murkoff Psychiatric Systems facility in my massive... All sorts of NDAs. I am very much breaking right now, but seriously, F those guys. Terrible things happening there. Don't understand it. Don't believe half the things I saw. Doctors talking about dream therapy, going too deep and finding something been waiting for them in the mountain. People are being hurt and Murkoff is making money. It needs to be exposed. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Hey, Darkner, good to see you. I have a camera. Oh, hell yeah. It has a battery. Miles Upshore, independent. That is very bright. Jesus. I think I actually need to turn... I turned the game brightness up a little bit. I think I'll turn it down just a touch, because that was unbelievably bright. Keep saying. Okay. Here we go. I'm a Quest Service Specialist at an automotive repair shop. Moved up from a tech because it pays 18 per hour. So not enough pay the bills. Damn. Sorry to hear that, dude. Objective... Well, that's a great start. Um, investigate Mount Massive Asylum. Alrighty. Should be easy. This is a very eerie. Red sky at night. Shepherd's delight. No blood will be spilled today. Hell yeah. Oh, I can lean. Okay. Good. Right click is my camera. How do I night vision? 
F. F to night vision. Okay. I'm going to turn the sensitivity up a teeny, tiny, teeny, tiny, teeny, tiny little bit. Much better. Let's giggity, 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 giggity. Foiled by a chain link fence. Double the door quickly. Left mouse button. Double the door slowly. Hold left mouse button and move slowly. <laughs> squeaky, squeaky. Event recorded. Adding a note in your notebook. Press N to read it. I start feeling sick just looking at this place. Mount Massive Asylum, shut down amid scandal and government secrecy in 1971. Reopened by Mirko of Psychiatric Systems in 2009 under the guise of a charitable organization. Cell phone reception cut off abruptly a mile out. More like a jammer than a lost signal. The Mirkov Corporation has a long track record of disguising profit as charity, but never on American soil. I don't know what this accent is. Okay, so I need to record things to get notes. Noted. <laughs> this is an ambulance? This is a military truck, dude. That's an APC. An armored personnel carrier, right? Or are all American trucks just this big and freaking armored to the teeth? Bloody hell. Hey, Slinky. Slinky Games. Good to see you. Try to figure out where I'm going in life is a lot harder than expected. Same, bruv. Same. <sighs> right. Hello? Hello? Okay. No, that's clearly just an, an ambulance. You know how patients get into an asylum? I don't know if you're joking or not. Is this how, like, American ambulance are? It literally says Mercs on it. That's some mercenary shit right there. I just hit my Windows key. Great. You all saw a sneak preview of the next game that I want to do. It's a game nobody has ever played except for me. Uh, I get the feeling I need to go up there, but I want to try this first. Dingleberries. I should probably keep the camera up for everything, right? I know it kind of smudges the picture just a little bit. But it also... Like, it's so I can record stuff, right? That's the whole point of me being here. Can you go through the entire game without recording a single event? And then get out and be like, Oh, no! I, I don't have... I swear to God, they're... Generating humans with massive penises in there. Humongous dong bongla boogers. I mean, for real, it was... It, you've seen sausage parties. This was like an elephant trunk party. It was absolutely insane. And then everyone's gonna be like, well, where's the evidence? You're like, it's all on my car. Bruh. Okay. Clearly, they are not maintaining their systems. I'm turning down because public penis! And now we continue. Thank you for your patronage. Pleasant night. Um. Oh, yeah! Brad! I love it when your penis is right there in my face! Oh, Brad! Oh, Brad! Yeah! There you go. Just, just for you, Pleasant Nights. Brad, it's so sinful, but it feels so good. Yeah, this stream is NSF. I'm pretty sure I put in the title this NSFW, so I'm going to put out all my NSFW screaming into the w world now. That's not a good sign. No notes on this, really? All right. Uh, Ava Orchid, thank you very much for the five gift bomb. That is incredibly generous of you. Thank you so much. Beatery. Is that not important? No. Oh. oh, that's not. Okay. Cool. Somebody is taking a train. Not a new style for a stream? I need to fix that. Um, what's the easiest way for me to do it? I really hope this doesn't break my mouse or I'm going to be mad. There we go. I almost set the language to Russian. That would have been funny. Um, Pleasant Ice, thank you very much. That was very kind of you. Thank you very much. Both you and Ava. 
out here getting us up to 305 subscribers. Thank you very much. That is unbelievably generous of you. Aha. Yoink. Documents. Project Wall Rider. Uh, Billy. Initial date of patient consult. 2009. When did this game come out? Patient claims to have progressed to self-directed lucid dream states. Morphogenic engine activity observed at unprecedented scale. Containing stage 4 hormone schedule. Darcy, so thank you very much for giving a gift sub to Sparkly Sally. It's very much appreciated. Thank you. Spirometry revealed no bronchial accumulation. That's good. No liquid in the lungs. Hemat hematocrit hematocrit centrifuge again failed to separate erythrocytes. Highly worrisome. I'm assuming that's like one of those dialysis machines that like separate like hema is like hemos like blood maybe and centrifuge is like a spinny thing and you, you spin stuff to like separate it. I know those words. MRI revealed arithmetic REM NREM cycle. Laughter and NREM sleep state. That's a sleep thing. Interview notes. Billy has to win the status of his mother's lawsuit against Merkel in the asylum. This represents a catastrophic breach of security. It's despite Billy's claim that he discovered truth in the blood dreams of Dr. Trevor. Hmm. Uh, hematology? I'm just, yeah, I'm just wondering that's blood related. Um. The only tracking on company records, one which requires uh, executive member D. All orders of security personnel must be questioned and video security improved. Okay, that's a great start. Hello? Can I record this? Oh, it's so spooky. Hematologist would be a blood specialist. Ha 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 Hello? Hello? Let me in! Let me in! Okay. Hmm. Let's just close that. Ew. Ew. Who would drink Pepsi? That's disgusting. Oh. All right, let's get out of here. Okay. Better than Dr. Pepper? Barely. The hell just happened there? All right. I don't actually know what happened there. There's people running. That's not good for me, right? Hmm. 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 I need a new mask, but I need a keyboard. <laughs> what the shit? Uh Oh, he's missing a head. Oh. Oh. Try to think of the bits. This is a bit loud. Let me know how the volume is, chat. Hello. Hmm. Thought maybe there'd be a document or something here. Hmm. Hmm. Oh God! Oh God! They killed us. You got out. The variants. You can't fight them. You have to hide. You can unlock the main doors. Go to security and control. I have to get the fuck out of this terrible place. I can't. Thank you very much for the five level five hype train chat. It's very kind of you. Thank you. Okay, someone really was trying to get ahead in life, huh? Jesus Christ. Noticing a distinct lack of females in this place. This might be an all an all male asylum. Okay. I guess we'll find out. Hmm. Oh, ha! that's handy. Dude just wants to give you a wipe. <laughs> oh, maybe a document or something there. 
Hey, Vorkin, thank you for the gift sub. And hey, man, thank you very much for the 500 bits. Very kind of you. Thank you. I probably shouldn't try and follow that guy in there, huh? Mm-hmm. What? Ah, ah. Oh, God. Hey, that's the guy I know that. Oh, God. Ah. Okay, I remember that bit. I remember that bit. From, from like, whenever this game released. I asked that question earlier, and I didn't listen. When did this game release again, Who are you? 2013. Yeah, I remember that bit from 2013 when I watched someone else play. 11 I, years ago. I see. Merciful God, you have sent me an apostle. Guard your life, son. You have a calling. The experiment didn't work with females. I'm going to go on a limb and say that it wouldn't have been acceptable to have any females in this game back in 2013. And I'm pretty sure if they tried to remake the game today, it still wouldn't be acceptable to have any females in. Claim the gospel. Okay. Uh, I'm inside. I'm inside. Bodies everywhere. Blood. Burn marks. Heads lined up like bottles behind a bar. Dead Murkoff scientists hung from the ceiling. Their badges say Murkoff Advanced Research Systems. Mars! Murkoff's longtime memo has been to profit off the exploitation of supposed charity. F the third world and bankroll another billion. How did Murkoff think they would make money off a building full of crazy people? There's some kind of tactical cop pinned like a pig on a spit. Tells me to get the F out and then dies. Would have been a good thing to hear when I could still leave the way I came. I don't know what was stopping him from leaving the way he came. At that point. I'm, I'm thinking morbid curiosity, maybe? Jesus Christ. Are all these men headless? Yeah, okay. Bloody hell. Ooh. Nice. Nicey, 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 nice. I last wouldn't be at last with females. What makes you say that? Females can be just as crazy as males. The number of Reddit posts I've seen of women waking up after a dream beating the shit out of their spouses. Not to mention, it would be sexist to imply that females are not as crazy as males, because equal to equality, Jesus Christ, equality is a thing. Did you get the DLC as well? Yes. In the master of procedure of Mount Massive Psychiatric Center, Murkoff Psychiatrics, oh. Affidates have been made for the board of directors by Murkov Hardline Security. It is reason to believe catastrophic security failure of psychiatric center with imminent danger of environment contamination. Grant full access to all sale. Okay, so. Basically, people at Murkov were aware that something bad could happen, so they sent in security forces. Then something bad happened, and the security forces were not enough. Huh. Let's go this way. Hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. It would just be different, I guess. Have you never watched like? Oh. Witness me. You need to watch some like real crime dramas, dude. Yeah, all right, man. Oh. Aha! Did the door just close or did I just get hit in the face? Okay. Um. This door needs a key card. Son of a biscuit. Um. I don't know, dude, equality, yeah? Next time the draft happens, let's go 50-50. <laughs> In fact, you know what? <laughs> Women have a lot to make up for when it comes to warfare, all right? Next time a draft happens where people are being called to war, it should be 100% women. That would be true equality. Making up for past numbers. Yeah! Everyone on board with that chat? Everyone who agrees, say aye. <laughs> And then I'll, I'll petition the, the, the... Why do we have to pay for it? Why do we have to die? 
We'll end up doing diplomacy? I don't think you would. There are a lot of really bad... Um, like, there's a lot of differing opinions that are just as ingrained in females than males. So, I don't think there would be democracy. <laughs> um, if the people don't support war, it shouldn't happen. I mean, that's all well and good, Ava, right? It would be amazing if every American didn't support war. But you gotta tell the Russians that as well. <laughs> you know? It doesn't work if only America doesn't support war. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. Where the hell do I get this keycard then? I'm obviously missing something. I can't go through that door without something. Maybe this guard at the end of the hallway had it. I just missed it. Put that away for me. You got a keycard? Anyone got a keycard? Hello? I don't think Russians get a choice. Well, it's a bit of both, isn't it? You can't have a war if at least some of the country doesn't support you. Go through here? Yeah. Anyway, that's fine. Let's just move away from politics. I just thought it'd be really funny to, <laughs> to say that, you know? <laughs> it always gets a fun reaction out of people. No! How dare you suggest that more women go to war than men? Ah! <laughs> I don't know where the security guard is with my freaking key card. Even if there's just like keys. Anyone know where the key card slash keys are? Because I have done a full circuit of all the playable area and I am 100% confused. Hmm. There's a book about that, darn Maybe the elevator. Does that happen every time I push this button? <laughs> um. Just on the line, someone on purpose? No. Um. Hmm. Yeah, key card on you. Key card. Key card. Key card. Anyone got a key card? Anyone got a key card? You, Mr. Pooper, you got a key card? You do not. Can't go in the security room because I don't have a key. Does he have a key card? Doesn't look like it. Don't know how he got in there. I could seem to break out again and again. Hmm. Maybe break the window? Any security door worth its salt would have a bulletproof window at minimum, right? But you'd expect the key card to be here. This is like a natural place for it to be. But it's not. And nobody knows where it is. In my chat. <sighs> yeah, Darkner, I, I asked for a hint earlier. So yes, absolutely. Give me a hint. Go back to the main room. Okay. Thought I already did a full circuit in the main room. We'll try again. Glass, there's intestines, there's a dude with no head, it's a toilet. Oh, 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 here we go. Hang on, might be in here. Hello? Ah, a radio! That is not helpful to me. Okay, so it's not in here. Ah, dingleberries. I really thought we had it there. Okay. Oh, this looks promising, though. 
Okay. Okay. You got a key card? Anyone got a got a card key? Let me reload the battery on this. Oh! Oh, we're here now. Bam! It's not one direction door. You cool, buddy? We cool? What the shit, dude? His eyes have been carved out and they've sewn his nose shut! And his mouth! Oh no, his mouth is fine. They sewed his nose shut. Oh. Oh, Ava Orchid, thank you very much for the 25 pound. That is... Insanely generous. You guys, oh, you guys enjoying some, some TV? I can't get past you. What the hell's wrong with his face? Sorry! Look up again, please. I don't know what the hell's going on here. Crowd of broken men watch a dead channel. They look like patients survive whatever happened here, but nobody's home. Somebody's taking a train to Broken Mind Junction. Somebody is so fluffed they can barely function. All aboard! <laughs> Keyguard. Excellent. Thank you very much for the help, Darkness. No more spoilers. Mr. Twitchy over there. You dudes freaking out? I'd be too. I'm not disturbing your TV program. That's the most normal looking guy in here. What a cheerful chap. What a chipper fella. What an absolute glorious monster. Oh, Jesus Christ! Get him out! Please! You got your hands! Get clean! You got Ow! And now he's doing the worm. Thank you very much for the 25 pound again, Ava. That is unbelievably generous. Thank you. Okay. I'm not skilled. I'm not, I'm not skilled at all. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. It's all good. It's all great. It's proper. No, you went behind you. Why would I need to do that? Why would I need to know that? Hey, dude. Can I get out of here now? <laughs> I got the feeling this isn't gonna go how I wanted it to go. But hey, maybe it will. Uh... Oh. 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 Oh! <laughs> I like how it says just hide, don't even try to fight. Oh, don't open this. God, he's so fat. He's like me. Smack off, you f freaking freaker. Okay. Oh, God.
Okay. Dear sirs, fill report pending. No immediate action is required in part of Markov Corp. The profit potential of Project Wallrider remains staggeringly high. The four fatalities contain enough ambiguous data to make any litigation, if evidence is correctly managed, impossible. Project Wallrider remains a dangerous initiative, and there will almost certainly be further casualties. Night Hunter, thank you very much for the Prime. As with the others, however, family and government interest in the patients is so low as to make any chance of legal actions vanishingly unlikely. Violence among patients is increasing as the morphogenic engine therapy gets closer to producing working models. But a combination of physical and chemical restraints has proved sufficiently effective to assure continued control and profit. <clears throat> uh, hypnotic experimentation research work was continued in building 13 amount massive preserve in Colorado using the following subjects. A post-hypnotic of the night before, pointed finger, you will sleep, was enacted. Mrs. Jackson, Mrs. Jackson and Pierce. Okay. Immediately progressed to his deep hypnotic state with no further suggestion. Miss Pierce was then instructed, having previously expressed a fear of firearms in any fashion, that she would then use every method at her disposal to awaken Miss Jackson, now in a deep hypnotic sleep, and failing this, she would pick up a nearby pistol and fire at Miss Jackson. She was instructed that her rage would be so great she would not hesitate to kill Jackson for failing to awaken. Miss Pierce carried these suggestions to the letter, including firing the unloaded pneumatic pistol gun at Jackson, and then proceeding to fall into a deep sleep. After proper suggestions were made, both awakened and com expressed complete amnesia for the entire sequence. Miss Pierce was again handed a gun, which she refused, in an awkward state, to pick up or accept from the operator. She expressed absolute denial that the foregoing sequence had ever happened. I gotta find a new hiding spot. Before the piggy muncher comes back. That's not Who's good. There? Nobody. Nobody's there. Don't worry about it. Well, that's not a good sign, is it? Turn on two gas pumps, main breaker to restart. Jet. Frick. Okay, good start. Pump room. Just in case. Don't turn that off. I just turned it on. Okay. I could seem to see power again and again. Okay, I think. Ooh, I think we're in the clear. Okay. Can I close it quietly? No. What if I do this? Then this. Then this. And then we wait. Like a genius. Uh, Silent Hill Mama, yeah, I'd never played Outlast. I had watched Outlast when it first released back in 2013. Never played it. This has been quite fun. Hmm. I think he just opened another locker.
Okay. Just one more button. Probably over there. Oh, maybe it'll be the door he came from, actually, right? Yeah, he's going back up there. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's really not good. Um, hmm. He came... That existed in real life? Oh, well, we might need to do some reading at the end of this stream then. Asylums. I know IRL asylums were awful. I thought they meant that like, this place actually existed. Building's based off a of real asylum, I believe. Don't know much about this specific asylum. Okay. Made asylums in general. Right, okay, that makes more sense. Ah, oh, shit. I'm gonna turn this on and someone's gonna come up behind me. That's the CIA. CIA hypnotic homicide. Oh, MK Ultra? Wait, the CIA was working in this place? Well, that's kind of messed up, isn't it? <laughs> the CIA knew about this shit. clear. Really? Nobody. Yes! Ha ha ha! Suck my ass, bitch! I got it. Run! Oh, God! He's fast! So, does my health regenerate? Seems like it might regenerate. Oh god, big fat guy's over here again. Uh, 
That's not good. Doesn't that red light mean someone's actively watching that camera? Or does that just mean it's active? What is lobotomy? A lobotomy was, and still is in some places, a way to correct adverse mental behaviours in patients by removing sections of their brain, commonly the, pr the frontal lobe, I believe? Oh! That's not good! It's commonly used to treat stuff like epilepsy and... Which you can't leave. Not yet. Depression and stuff. So much yet amygdala? Maybe it was the amygdala. I don't know for sure, but I remember what it was used for. Will you see it? Can you? Our lord, the wall rider, tearing his truth into the unbelievers. The only what way the? out of this place is the truth. Accept the gospel. All doors will open before you. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. And you received twenty-five pound from. <laughs> Thank you very much for the support. Okay, so we have been committed. Yeah, the can't the human brain survive with only half of the brain? If it's done like very young. Because of the way the brain develops. The priest, Father Martin, brought me here to show me something. <clears throat> Things are gonna be a witness for whatever bat bat something crazy he's trying to sell me. This Dr. Warnicky is at the center of whatever went wrong here, but he died more than 10 years ago. Rest in peace, says the blood on the wall. Oh. Thank you, kind gentleman. Um, sorry, I'm getting a Discord message. So I always want to start streaming. And then mobile Discord doesn't update to show me what it is. Lost in Dark by DA Games. I suggest checking out this song. Uh, we'll see. Okay, it's VLDL. I don't care. Love watching your stuff. Hate your notifications. All right, let's go. Hmm. Hmm. That blood is rendered on top of him. <laughs> Probably not the most important thing I was meant to take away from that scene, but how oh, that scene. All right. Need a hand? Hey. What's up? <laughs> no? No, you all good? You have such a beautiful smile. <laughs> hey. Fr oh. Okay. I think we'll leave that one alone. Who's this? Hey. Maybe Father Martin's man. Maybe. He looks nervous. Oh. I would like to kill him. As would I. The preacher asked us not to. It would be impolite. Not here. We give him a running start. There's an idea. And when we kill him, we kill him slow. Such patience. I want his tongue. And liver. They are yours. Hmm. I like my tongue and liver. I'd rather not give it up if that's okay with you. I have. They have penises. Why is this one lit? Weird. So we'll try not to look at the 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 the, the plums and bananas as we play this game. 
But no promises I'll be able to skip them all because I've heard there are a lot in this game. You are one creepy son of a biscuit, aren't you? So... I wonder if... Uh, don't spoil this for me, obviously, chat. But I wonder if, like, the physical mutations on these guys are something that the doctors here are doing, or, like, causing. Or if it's, like, caused by the therapy and it's making their body undergo mutations. Again, don't spoil. I'm just talking out loud. Please, for the love of God. So where am I meant to go here? Maybe this way? Son of a biscuit, this should be sweet, right? Not necessarily. How do I get out of here? Why do I always get lost in every level of every horror game ever? Um, I can't remember the button to see what I'm meant to be doing. Can I open this? Sorry, guys. Oh, sorry. No. Okay. Didn't think so. Maybe there's somewhere I can jump? Hey, you got a key card? No. Can I jump over here? No. Oh. No. Um. Anybody know what I'm gonna be doing here? Normally, I would, like, bang my head against the wall until I figure it out, but I am trying to entertain an audience, and it's hard to entertain when I'm wandering in circles like an idiot. Can I take this wheelchair? Try the other doors? I thought I tried them all. Sorry, buddy. You're stuck in there. Oh, here we go. Why would you take the wheelchair that's evil so I can stand on it? He doesn't need it. Oh. Oh. God damn it. What the fuck is the matter with you? You weren't invited to this, you goddamn sicko. Do I get a note from this? You're sick. I'm sick. Okay. That guy is, um... I did get a note for that. Wonderful. Necromantic. F this place. Seriously, just F this place. Dying keeps moving lower on the list of the worst things that could happen to me here. That is... A lot of necro. No mantic. Oh. Goodbye. Hmm. 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 Oh, God. Okay. You alright, buddy? Oh, he has no peen. Why couldn't they have done that for all the other guys? That would have made this a lot less awkward. And a lot less necromantic. Okay. God always provides a way. Follow the blood. I thought you were meant to fear the old blood. Hey, Taggy. How you doing? That's exactly what I was asking, Darkner. Even if they'd left the testes on because, oh, testosterone adds to the effect, whatever. You know, for like a lore perspective. They could have removed the... The banane, you know? And if they'd done it to the necromantic guy, well, then he would have been downright out of things to do. Have I watched Shogun? No. I don't have Disney+. Plus. I'm doing alright. Hmm. 
Uh, Dr. Zainer gave me your info to contact regarding the cancellation of the arts program. My patient, Martin Achman, has made an enormous stride in his therapy on account of his finger painting. In just the week since cancelling the art program, his schizoaffective assertions of some higher calling have accelerated enormously. Please just let the man finger paint. The few dollars you're saving on temper paint is more than swallowed by the cost of clozapine. I can't imagine a logic at plays here unless Markov wants our patients to become more disengaged with reality. Well, I think you just hit it on the head there, mister, didn't you? What's this way? I know it said oh, follow the blood, but well, now I'm curious. It's a prison cell. They weren't experiments. They were rituals. A conjuring. Okay. Your mom's a ritual. <laughs> a conjuring. Con how about you conjure up some clothes for the the naked people, huh? It sure would be nice. That's another reason why there's no woman in this game, by the way. Because if there were naked women in the game, uh, it would absolutely be um, more more like questionable, and people would be like, "Nah, this is terrible." <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong. Hmm. Don't get me wrong. It's still horrible, but. People do have... Aren't both questionable? Oh, absolutely. From an objective point of view, both are terrible things to witness. But people are, people tend to be a lot more vocal about violence against women. Which absolutely is fair. Don't get me wrong. There should, it should be for both. Are there different styles between games and movies? Not really. I can't really think of many movies where women get... Um... Seriously harmed? That's not good. Can anyone think of any movies where women get like tortured and harmed? Other than the Terrifier. I've seen it in the Terrifier. I don't really watch too many, to be honest. Ow. Bitch. The Saw movies? Hostel? I haven't seen Hostel. I haven't watched Saw, so that's two that I just haven't seen, so I wouldn't have known. Uh, high Tension? I haven't seen that either. Okay, so it seems like there are people that are movies in it. Um, I was thinking like Game of Thrones and stuff, where it was all, like, all men that were getting the worst things done to them. And a woman mostly just got assassinated or stabbed in the stomach. No, I, I, I stand corrected. I did not know that. I don't watch too many horror movies that are like just mindless violence. I tried the Terrifier and it was okay, but then the dude literally sawed a woman in half starting from her vagina. And I, I was like, okay, this is just kind of needless. <laughs> it's like, like, I really like the idea of this creepy clown guy going around killing people. I was like, oh, this is fun. And then that happened. I was like, oh, this is less fun. The fun just got significantly lower now. <laughs> Okay, I think we're in the clear now. Follow the blood. Okay, so that's unlocked. Descent is another one. I think I tried to watch Descent a couple of times. Uh, I don't know if video games are different from movies, but from the sounds of it, there might be, right? Because I can't really think of any video games where there's graphic female mutilation. Maybe in Agony, but I never played Agony, so I wouldn't know. Can anyone think of any? Hell, even sex scenes in video games get them classed really terribly. Let alone if women got the necro treatment there. Agni's hot garbage anyhow. I like the idea of the game. I, I hated the execution. The execution was terrible and it was quite clear what they were wanting. AVP Rec Room a bit. The Pride Alien targeted women to infect. I don't remember that. I only watched uh, the 
That's the third one, right? No, that's the second one. I only watched that once. Have a good one, Kato. Okay, so those guys are trying to kill me now. Wonderful. They're in my blood if they want to get out. Um But having said that, 2013 was a very different time as well. Uh a lot of things have changed socially since then. Can you think of any games that have come out recently that have been like Outlast? For the life of me, I can't think of any. Other than Agony. But again, Agony was more like a, a sick man's pornographic video game. Or a sick woman's pornographic video game. Versus like a horror game. Pro proper purge gate maintenance is crucial to Project Wall Rider security. Please refer to Markov Core Maintenance Manual. M. M. Okay. Or seek guidance from survived proper security clearance. Purge gates, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Do you guys remember how much drama hatred spawned? That's a weird pattern. And that video game wasn't even all that bad. My brain is empty right now, yeah. Twinsies. Okay, hang on. It says follow the blood, but what's in here? I think I just saw something move. Okay, let's follow the blood. What could possibly go wrong if we check the showers, huh? Shag me arse. Not in that way. Blacker than a nun's arse crack in here. Oh! Big guy's collecting trophies. I can't shake Chris Walker, the big ugly fluffer who likes ripping off people's heads. I hear him muttering about security protocols, containment. What if he's not the problem? What if he's trying to fix it? Hmm. Interesting. What if he is? I mean, if we hear him yell, little piggy, we know to run. I feel like gore when done well, or even like, <sighs> it's going to sound awful, even like assault. Um, of the more primal nature, or, se or I'll just come out and say it, or even like sexual assault in movies, if done well, can really enhance the narrative. But it has to be handled in a really careful way. Otherwise, it just it just comes off as tacky and oh god, it just comes off as tacky and egregious, you know. Like, in this game, it seems pretty... I can kind of understand it, except for those two being naked. I don't get that. But, like, earlier on, people doing that to the corpse, like, it just kind of enhances the feeling of, Oh, God. Oh, God. What the hell is this place? They're just aspiring to this. Maybe it's because they seem to be very intelligent, right? Maybe it's something to do with their intelligence, thinking that clothes are restrictive or something. I don't know. We'll find out more as we as we continue, I'm sure. But I'm really enjoying this so far. It's pretty fun. But then you get movies that kind of just glorify it, and it's like, well, what, what was the point? Like when I was watching Terrifier. I really couldn't tell the point of it, right? 
Which I guess is the point. Like the point is it was pointless violence. I don't know. It, it just it just kind of threw me off a little bit, you know. It was weirdest wank I've had in a while. <laughs> it's a, that's a joke. For the record, it's a Sean Locke reference. Rest in peace, Sean Locke. You're a legend. I'm pretty sure he said frustrating wank though, not. Oh god. Oh god. I think he can get. Oh, there we go. You'd be surprised the logic of those not mentally sound. As someone who's lived like that, Lady Fluffbutt, I wouldn't be surprised. When you when you live your life not like mentally there, especially people who don't have the presence of other people around them. That can really skew your sense of both right and wrong and ah, what the f ah, ah, ow! <laughs> It's amazing how much being around other people helps keep you grounded. Oh Jesus oh my god, how many bodies? <gasps> oh that's gotta smell disgusting! Oh how come you won't have to kill yourself? Oh, the veins die. How fast is he? At least he can't smell us. If I can't see him, he shouldn't be able to see me. That's my logic. Ava, thank you very much for the gift sub. I know, I mean, I, I'm in two minds about it. Because on one hand, human media is meant to explore stuff that people are uncomfortable with in order to challenge our perspectives and explore ideas. And then on the other hand, there's people who whack off on that stuff and they're kind of weird. <laughs> so you really gotta try to find line there. Oh! Oh god, he's faster! Wrong way. <laughs> faster, faster, faster! <laughs> Can we break through that? Are we in the clear? I think we might be in the clear. Oh! Hey! How you doing? <laughs> Don't do that to me, dude! Jesus! Maybe that guy has a key card. How does a jail cell like that even work? Have you played both Evil Lane games? I played the first one. Hey. Why are you following me? Whoa, stop that. You freak. What am I doing here? Find an alternate path to the showers. I don't think I'm going to find an alternate path in here. I don't know why I came in here. I have a lovely one, Tavi. Thank you very much for popping by. So that's where we came from. No, nope, that's the way we have to go. Okay. Yeah, like, 
the evil within had his gore don't get me wrong but it didn't feel anything like this game i'm don't get me wrong i'm not hating on this game i'm really enjoying this game um but like the evil within score felt like it was leading towards a narrative versus this game where it's just like holy shit these people are messed up there's gore everywhere what is going on you know two different two different styles what am i doing in here i don't see a hole in the wall anyway Oh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> there we go. <gasps> Duh. Hey. Nurse. I'm gonna need some help getting busy. <laughs> Nurse. Um. But now that I'm embarking on this journey, in uh, do you need a hand, buddy? No. Now that I'm embarking on this journey to like the older horror games, all the ones that I've missed. Oh, please don't jump at me. Oh, come on! My hero. Thank you. Oh, God! Not as heroic as I thought, but thank you. Oh, this sucks. Hey, friend. Please don't push me! Thank you. Hey, Meg Meg Chicken, lovely to see you. It has been a while since I last saw your lovely face here. Okay. Um. Witness. But yeah, now that we're doing like a journey of all the older horror games, someone suggested a game called I think it was Cold. Was it Cold Fear? Hang on, I actually need to verify this because I need to add it to my wish list so I don't forget again. Because it looked interesting. Um, was it this? Yeah, Cold Fear. Uh, something about like a, a, a um, like a, a, a boat, and you go on it to find out what's going on, and apparently it's quite good. Obituary. Dr. Rudolf G. Wernicke, age 90, passed away during the work he loved on February the 28th, 2009. That was 15 years ago, chat. He was born in 1918 in Munich. Okay, he was a nationalist. Germany, and achieved fame in the mathematic and scientific communities for a paper written with early computing pioneer Alan Turing. Interesting. After cloudy history of the German war effort, nationalist he emigrated to the united states in 1949 with a visa from the state department which is a true thing that happened after world war ii the united states snapped up some of the more less public but still questionable scientists to conduct studies and uh things for them in exchange for immunity so there there you go several decades of gone, which <laughs> It has its pros and cons, right? Like, pros, you're getting a lot of information that you wouldn't have otherwise gotten. The research that was done in World War II was inhumane, garbage, and should have never happened. But it was also very informative at, on the same token. Um, a lot of the research was done for the sick pleasure of the scientists and not really research. But a lot of really interesting advances in science happened because of it. Still a terrible situation. Still horrible, but if like, I don't know, if, if, if it was a scientist that was working under duress, you're like, I will shoot your family if you don't do this stuff. Then I would probably recruit that scientist. If it was a scientist that was like, I'm going to stab everyone, ah ha ha, probably would send them to the Munich trials. <laughs> Munich trials? Was that it? Nuremberg trials, sorry. Um where Dr. Wernicke retired to pursue landscape photography and care for his cats. He came to Colorado shortly after the turn of the millennium to pursue... He's still alive, isn't he? For the charitable work for the Murkoff Corporation. I'm pretty sure... Because they're, they're mentioning Wernicke a lot. I... He did not kill his enemies. They're mentioning Wernicke a lot. I'm thinking the reveal is going to be that Wernicke is still alive somehow. And there's this whole... 
Project Wall Riders, like, oh, how can I become immortal? Would rather send him to Mount Massive Asylum. I don't think most of them are under duress. Oh, no, absolutely not. Most of them were not under duress, but there would still be some who are under duress. I don't know what I would do in that situation. Imagine an entire country. Like, imagine if the entirety of the United States... Well, no, that's too big. Right. Say, say for example, you lived in France. Ow! Oh, shit. Hang on, we'll continue this conversation in a bit. Like, what would you do in a situation like that where the entire country turns on you if you don't do as you're told? I'd love to say I'd be brave enough to start a revolution. And I, maybe I would. Maybe push comes to shove, I would. But if the per people in charge had my wife and children held under duress, I mean, a lot of people would just do it they would say oh no i would fight but a lot of people would would do as they're told you know lazaret oh god don't go to google that doxes you um a lot of people would do as they're told and i hate to say it if there was no way out now don't get me wrong i would do absolutely everything i could to to get out i'm swear it's for a person horror game is it multiplayer single player I might need to check that out. Um, and my first step would be, how do I get out of here, right? Like, contact every other country, try and leave the second that, like, stuff like that started to happen, pack up and go, which is a very hard thing to do. A lot of wall rider text here. But that would be my first attempt, right? But then if that somehow was blocked, if, ex not extradition, um, what's it called? There's a word for it. Uh, refugees. If refugees weren't permitted from that country, say for example, like spies had been refugeeing out. Hey, Bean Wolf, good to see. You. Uh, then my, you would just kind of have to go along with it, right? I would do my, like I wouldn't do anything terrible. I would do my best. I wonder. In a war, right? These days, if we had a war similar to the one that happened in World War Two, where one side was obviously evil. If we had that these days, would it be possible to just, like, abandon your unit, run to the enemy side with your hands up, and say, Hey, I'm, I'm, please pretend I'm dead. Take me to your country. I will tell you everything I know about my country. My wife and children are held under duress, so please pretend I'm dead. I will come with you. I have no guns, okay? That's literally death, my guy. That's what I'm wondering. Because it's against the Geneva Convention to shoot people who surrender, but then at the same time, it's war, right? I, if, if, if a country is systematically murdering an entire group of people and you try and surrender to the wrong person, they might just put a bullet in the back of your head because you were one of those people. I don't know. It's... What the hell? Why was that guy smoking? It's a tricky situation. And one I'm pretty sure we'll never run into again. Don't get me wrong. Today's war is terrible. Well, I can't really say that because I'm not really super educated on the war. Never mind. I, I, I'm i keeping up to date on, like... I do not night hunt or I, I block anyone who tries to add me without asking first. I don't, I'm not really educated on the war. I know a lot about mobilization, how things are going, but I'm not really educated on the politics and what they're doing. So I can't really comment on that. So I'm going to retract the comment I was about to make. This god is real. What we've mistaken so long for ghost spirits madness, we were only willfully ignorant. The scales on Saul's eyes were fear. When you see beyond it, you truly see. This is the gift of the wall rider, the gospel of sand. The greatest sin in the world is willful ignorance of God. To receive a revelation, not spread it to latent flock, this place is sign away salvation. Okay. The father has been drinking a little bit too much of the Holy Spirit from the sounds of it.
But yeah, I hope we never get into a situation where stuff like that happens again. But again, it could be. I'm just not super, not super uh, educated on that front. And I really don't want to stir a pot where I'm just not educated on it, you know? Night Hunter, I don't add people from chat either. Um, I know... Chris, buddy, really? It's all well and good that you want to play a game with me sometime, and I, I appreciate you wanting to spend time with me. Oh, that's not good. Hey, Chris, we talking about it? Ow! But having people randomly join me when I'm playing games is my biggest pet peeve. I hate it. Say, for example, I'm playing Helldivers and someone just randomly joins. I had someone on, on a long-time friends list hop in on me. Uh, like, he's been on my friends list for ages, and he had just hopped in on me randomly in Helldivers, and I had to give him a dressing down. Because I told him before I added him, hey, listen, buddy, I, I, I will add you, but I hate people just dropping in on me. So, no. Uh, I do not accept friend requests from randoms, uh, especially if they just want to hop in on me randomly. I appreciate you wanting to, but if I accepted everyone who asked me to be their friend... Well, the number of friend requests I've denied on stream probably over 300 by now, and that's people adding without asking. <laughs> it just... I wouldn't be able to get anything done, so no. Uh, no, Night Hunter. I appreciate it, but no. Look, look at my friends list. There's nine people online, two people in game, and 15 offline. One of them is me. One of them is my friend of 15 years. One, two, three, four. I don't know who that is. <laughs> four of them are YouTubers. The rest are longtime friends, and I don't know who you are. So you are getting removed. There we go. I don't add friends. I just don't do it. I see Fister on that list. I love Fister. Haven't played with him in ages. Might not be able to play with him again because I no longer hang out with the um, the Gma Savers crew. I don't really know what to call them. I'm just grandma crew. Uh, but yeah, I love uh, I love Fister. Fister and Fisk are legends. But no, Night Hunter. And if that offends you, I apologize. The answer is still no. Okay. Does that say female dream? Female drain. Okay, so do, do I need to go find the male drain as well? Can't be a good fister vid. I love his thumbnails. They've got such surreal quality to them and it really makes you want to click. I tried to emulate fister's thumbnails, could not get them to look right. So I gave up and just continued to do my own thumbnails there. Which is like... Oh, God. My own thumbnail style is quite nice. Look at that ass. I would love to have as many muscles as Chris, dude. Look at them. That man's more muscle than fat, and he's like six times my weight. <clears throat> I don't even think... Do I have Darcy on my friends list? Oh, I do have Darcy on my friends list, but Darcy's also donated a ridiculous amount of money to me. So hey, if you want to donate over £10,000 to me, then we'll talk! I can't remember why I added Darcy. I think it was for a specific game. But Darcy's also in ah! Sorry! Sorry! That was a really girly scream! <laughs> I didn't know he was there! Ah! Close, 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 close! I, 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 I. I. Uh, oh, and yeah, Darcy gifts me. That's why I added Darcy. She wanted to gift me again. Um. But Darcy's very respectful, doesn't try and join me when I'm streaming or anything. She just gives me games. I wasn't in there the first time you looked, buddy. Oh, 
I can't. Uh, Darcy hasn't sent me 50 games, but she sent me a fair few. <laughs> And I feel bad because I think one of them I didn't finish, which was Lo Long Fallen Dynasty. I don't think there's actually I don't think there's any I haven't at, at least tried. Um uh, Long Fallen Dynasty was the last one. Oh come on! <laughs> Night Hunter, I'm always busy. Once I move house, I'm gonna be even more busy. Cause right now I'm not making YouTube videos except for the the secondary channel, which is going great, by the way. Not amazing, 150 pound in a, in a month, but this, it's, that's 150 pound more than I would have had. Um, I'm always busy though. If I'm not, um, if I'm not working on videos or editing stuff or getting stuff rendered for the second channel, I am streaming. I am cleaning out or looking after my reptiles, or playing with the friends I actually have for video games, which right now, the majority of the time when I'm playing with friends, I'm playing with Naquida, who I've shouted out a couple times on my YouTube channel. He's a really cool guy and he's teaching me StarCraft. He, he taught me how to play StarCraft too. It was really fun. Um, a sparkly Salad, the second channel has all the streams on it. It's the stream VODs. Uh, it is Icy Caress Unchained. I wonder if it'll show up on YouTube now or on Google now. Ha-ha! 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 We, uh, the full playthrough of Wolfenstein. The last episode of that comes up tomorrow. There's Armored Core. I need to make more playlists show up here. Uh, there's the Pacific Drive one. There's the Dinosaur Horror game that actually popped off a little bit. There's a fair look at that. Uh, yeah. So, go check that out. There's hours of content on there. If you ever miss a stream, then do it. I like how the banner, banner doesn't look like a meme. I don't actually know what the banner is on that. I think it might still be the crumbs banner, actually. It is still the crumbs banner. <laughs> Back when I was pretending to be a different channel. Okay, that was creepy. I mean, it, it's a... Uh, you, you watch what you want to watch, Meg Meg. Right now... My religious watching is Linus Tech Tips, unless it's something I'm not interested in. Uh, War of Graphics, because I really want to keep up on the state of the world right now. Are you going to post, post the stream to the page too? Yes, Jake Birds. Um, and Giant Grand Games, because I love Giant Grand Games. <clears throat> um, tomorrow is the last episode of Wolfenstein. That's already scheduled. That'll go up tomorrow, even if I die. So you don't need to worry about that. Uh, and then... The day after that, the first episode of Outlast will go. The, the doctor's dead, you know that, right? Dr. Barrett died before he even started working here. Monster Rife with the 75 pound? I'm still not adding you on Steam. Don't you fucking die! Jesus Christ! That's a ridiculous amount of money! Thank you so much! Aww! Why the hell are you giving me money, dude? You gotta save your. save it! Thank you. Hey, Ice Nexus. Thank you, for, thank you for subscribing. And thank you so much, Monster Eye, for the unbelievably generous support. Thank you so much. And thank you, Ice Nexus. You make my sick day better. I mean, if you're sick, surely you should be using the money to buy medicine? What kind of dead dog? I, I still, I'm, I'm... Every, every five minutes this game's mentioning is Dr. Wernicke, I'm guaranteeing you he's not dead. Guarantee. We're gonna get to the end, and he's gonna rock up like. Bah! I'm going to the female ward. Seems like all the cycles kind of lined up for today in the female ward. So let's go have a look. Never mind. Let's go this way. Um. Yeah. No. I. I. Uh, this will be up. Not tomorrow, but the day after. Good movie. Not a good movie. It's an alright movie. Um, but yeah, so we're, we're interspersing games I want to play with horror games I've never played. Because don't get me wrong, I'm enjoying this, but I'm managing, my legs are shaking. 
<laughs> like my legs are jiggling non-stop and I'm managing my anxiety by talking a lot. <laughs> so... <laughs> uh, I... Who's that? I'm scared to be honest. I'm not scared. I'm anxious. I don't like being chased, but the only scary things in this game have been like the. Because in Alien Isolation, I was always scared the alien was going to come out behind me and grab me and kill me. In this game, I'm more like. The only scares have been like loud jump scares versus Alien Isolation, where it was more of a creeping horror that made me scared all the time. Um, but I'm very anxious that something's going to chase me. I don't like being chased. <laughs> I really don't like being chased. Played your first Resident Evil today and you were screaming non-stop. Uh, Resident Evil 7 and 8 are... Resident Evil 7, very scary. Resident Evil 8, a little scary. Um, Resident Evil 8 was less scary. There was one section... <sighs> There was one section in Resident Evil 8 that really terrified me. And that was the baby. That messed me up on a core level. Did, is that playthrough up on Icy Crest? Yes! Here it is! You wanna be a real legend. Nobody cares about your shit game. It died years ago. Honestly. Please, please hurry up and... Please hurry up and go away. The baby wasn't that bad. Mm. Oh my god! <laughs> no, wait, wait, there we go. Hi! We had 2,000 subscribers back then? What? What is my career now? Did I have hidden in the... Okay. I don't know. I, that that section really messed me up. But yeah, so that's available on Icy Crest main channel. If you want to watch it. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I really don't like this. I've never played the Resident Evil remix. Uh, I played Resident Evil 1 and... No, sorry, I played Resident Evil 2 when I was four years old. Uh, my babysitter my babysitter used to let me play it. Um, one of my baby, The good babysitter <laughs> used to let me play it. Um, and I ne I've never played it since. I considered doing the Resident Evil remix, but... I don't like the camera angles. There's no way they're doing a Resident Evil 6 remake, Lady Fluff, but that game's the reason they rebooted the entire se- The reason they rebooted the entire series. What the hell is going on here? Oh god, I turn around and now I'm confused. Oh, it's Chris. Smacking hell. Okay. But we got a lot of... A lot of I, by the way, Unchained People, and I'm gonna ask this again in the uh, main channel community. Please, get up! Ah! 
Main channel community tab. You got, what's your favorite horror game that you want me to play? You know, I'm really enjoying this. Oh God. I'm really enjoying this. Have a lovely sleep, Mac Mac. Thank you so much for popping by. Oh God. I'm getting back. If you want me to get back, why are you following me? Oh. oh, oh, that's not very necromantic. Void for requires a crew sparkly salad. I'm never trying it again. That was ruined for me, unfortunately, with the group. They did not enjoy it, and I did not enjoy it because of that. If Brett and Luke play it, I'll play it with them. Otherwise, no. That guy just spawned in in front of me. That's not good noise. Have a lovely sleep, Darcy. Thanks for popping by. Man, I hope we get back up to 2,000 subscribers one day. Could you imagine? I thought the sewer couldn't smell any worse. Hundreds of bodies crammed into a room, thousands of flies. Is this the priest's way out? Why is my phone going off? Thank you so much, Monster Rife, for the 75. Monster Rife? Are you female? <laughs> Have I been calling you dude this whole time? And you've been a woman. <laughs> I'm so sorry. God damn it. Why does everyone do this? If I call you a dude and you're not a dude, just be like, hey, I see. By the way, not a dude. You dumbass. I have no preference. <laughs> Thank you very much, Monster Eye, for the support. I do appreciate it. Thank you. I had no idea. I'm so sorry. I know you say there's no preference, and I appreciate that, but... I still feel like I should apologize. Asshole Cress over here. Everyone. It's, it happens so many goddamn times. It's alright, at least I know Miss Sheba's a woman. I got that going for me. Darcy, I hope you stick around long past then. If you enjoy the content. If you don't enjoy the content, you should probably just, you know... Look after yourself. You alright, buddy? God, it's been ages since we last saw a battery. Everyone looking forward to Wolfenstein 2? Is there anything I should expect for Night Hunter? Thank you very much for the five gift bomb. That's unbelievably generous of you. Thank you. Is there anything I should be aware of for um Wolfenstein 2, by the way? Is it is it gonna be a game I really enjoy? Is it not as good as Wolfenstein 1? No spoilers, obviously. Just like, am I going to enjoy it as much? Because I really enjoyed Wolfenstein 1. It was great fun. Thank you so much, Night Hunter, for the five gift bomb. That is very generous of you. And that puts us up to 321 subscribers. Contains a Wolfenstein. Oh, and Kanani hasn't screwed the pooch and just let Bluebird get on with it. Blooper Team really... The medium was an amazing game. Was Blooper... Wait, no. Blooper's the layers of fear people, right? No. Yes. Yeah, I didn't like layers of fear. I'm thinking of amnesia. But I loved the medium. The medium was phenomenal. I love the latest amnesia game as well. Well... Uh, oh, we need to do the Phil Mattress series soon as well. What the hell? Thank you so much again, Night Hunter. You didn't like Layers of Fear? What did you dislike about it? It was very cookie cutter, Lady Fluffbutt. At least for me. This patient also unfortunately didn't make it. I tried my best, but I'm just a doctor, not a miracle worker. I'm also pretty new to this whole doctor thing, and I'm still working out all the kinks. Is one of those kinks necromantic? Because <laughs> that seems to be a thing down here. 
Anywho, someone's got to cut the fat from this Project Wall Rider disaster. We've been bleeding money ever since this thing went tits up on the account of that Billy kid. Billy the kid. But I've managed to slim back personnel by more than 80 people, which means short-term savings in salary and long-term savings in pension and healthcare costs. And I've been figuring out a lot on biology. I was on the fence about it before. Now I can say with absolute certainty that a person can't live without his kidneys. You learn something new every day. Still wakes the deep. Looks intriguing. Remind me about it when it comes out. I never played Returnal, um, but I heard good things about it. I want to do the full Metro playthrough shortly after we do the um, Wolf. We finish the Wolfenstein playthrough because the Metro really is one of my favorite games of all time, and losing that footage hurts me. Have a good one. I won't be live for much longer anyway, so don't you worry about it. I'm getting a headache. I think I didn't drink enough water today. No, we don't drink air because air doesn't go into our stomach. Um. Oh, I can just jump that. Okay. Oh God! Wrong way. <laughs> Why are you screaming, Wall Rider? These people are crazy. You belong in an asylum. Wait a minute. Once again, Night Hunter, Ice Nexus, Monster Rife, and Ava for the support today. And Pleasant Nights for the support today. And thank you, everyone else, for the bits and the tips and the commits. It's very generous. It's been a very successful day for me. Thanks to you guys. Thank you. It means a lot. Huh? Oh, God. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh God! Why are these people so strong? Who's down there? You're not one of them, are you? No! Get in the dumb waiter if you want to live. I'm Bob in the bloody dumbwaiter! Lift it! Lift it! Lift it! Hey, Bob! Thank you very much. Let's give some. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, that bullshit priest's guy. Made the right choice here, buddy. Poof, poof. Yeah, he's a witness or whatever. You must be exhausted. No, let's take a break, huh, buddy? You old two martini lunch? Hmm? Have a little con <laughs> I love this guy. Hellier than you look. A little car, you wouldn't kill you. Okay, here we go. Arms and legs inside the car. Oh, God. This guy's so funny. <laughs> I love it. Good. Okay, now I'm scared. Now I'm scared. Oh god, you wouldn't believe the shit I saw on Reddit today, by the way. I'm not even gonna talk no, about I it. I love the mountain air up here at night. Wait, wait, you, no, you let me out. Head out and take a stroll. <laughs> Go ahead, I'll wait here. Okay, let me out. Go on, run free. <laughs> I'm in no hurry. 
Nose to the grindstone. I like that. Okay, then. Right this way. Okay, you're hilarious, and I still love you, but this sucks. No! No, 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 no. Why did you have to do that? Why are you such a lovable asshole? God, he's funny, and he's clever, and he sounds really nice, but I swear to God, he's going to cut my nose off or something. Oh God, oh. We're putting that tongue to any use anyway. Oh. Because he told me, I was just trying to look at my own He's so funny, but <laughs> this is not good. Thanks so much for coming by. We'll begin your consultation in a moment. It'll just Oh my god. Uh, oh. oh, movies. And it'll give us a chance to talk. You know, I'm a bit worried how much time you've been spending with Father Martin. I, I know, I hope you haven't been letting him confuse you with all this. Oh, no, 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 in it is the simplest one, but what happens when all money is gone? Well, money becomes a matter of faith. And that's what I'm here for. It makes you believe. Oh my god! You paying attention? Don't pass that on me. No, 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 no! We made the consumer into the means of production. This thing is gonna sell itself. Oh! Oh my God! Oh God! Oh, yeah, don't get it. Oh, oh, did you imagine the crunch as the blades go through your bones? Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, you can go fluff yourself. Oh, God. I don't like the doctor. He pulled that thing out of the toilet and then. He's still alive. She's not just learning his nightmares. He worked so well. She can control it. And you can't control it. Nobody. Nobody. No, Molly! He'll find you! He'll kill you! He's coming now! Trigger! Trigger! Ah! I see what's happening. You're bored. You want a little attention. Perfectly understandable. I'm here for you. I'll give you very special attention. Does Trigger have the key? No. Oh. Fuck! Fuck, really? Uh -oh. You aren't gonna walk on me! 
If there's one thing I cannot goddamn stand, it's the queer! All these bureaucrats. Chill. Oh god, he's fast! Holy shit, he's fast! That's rare, you're not supposed to hide initially. I've never heard that voice line. Wait, what voice line? The one where he tells the guy that he wanted attention? Is that, has nobody ever hidden there before? I figured as soon as he started yelling out for Traeger, you're meant to hide, cause like bad things are coming. Thank you very much for the gifts up. Monster Rife, it's incredibly generous of you, thank you. Well then, you're welcome, chat. Apparently I play through games so thoroughly, you see shit you've never seen before. Or was it the quitter thing as well? Like, I hate a quitter. Oh, buddy. What are you trying to do? Yeah, I break games because I play games weird. <laughs> Stay away from anyone who's still alive because they will yell. Humans do not drink air. It doesn't go into their stomach. It doesn't get processed by the kidneys. Oh, shit. Oh, they refunded you. Okay, thank God. Thank you so much, Monster Rife, again. And thank you, Ava, for trying. Jesus. So I'm assuming this was the guy who found out that kidneys were, um, were required. It's going. It's going, Lord Ryoshi. I'm missing a couple of fingers, which I can see when I... Oh no, I can't see when I bring the camera up to my face. That's unfortunate. Let me sell you the degree! No! 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 I have insomnia! Fuck you! Shit! I'm back here. I don't have the key. We'll be safe up here. didn't get the key. Is this what happens when you get a vaccine? Ah! What the fuck? <laughs> I found him. Oh, 
I need to find this key. Um, I found quite a lot of unique bugs nobody's found because I was a volunteer bug tester. For I was a volunteer bug tester for uh, scavenger games for a while. Hey, nobody likes a quitter. So I found a lot of bugs that never made it to public. And I found a lot of bugs that made it to public, um, but nobody else found, so it was all good. Like bugs to get under the map. Ah, oh, shit. I would love to be curious for video games. I, it was one of my favorite things to do, uh, but they kept promise me, promising me that they would hire me and pay me eventually. They never did. So I gave it up. If someone offered me a QA, professional QA job for 60,000 a year, I'd do it. I wouldn't quit streaming permanently, but my day job would become QA. I don't know where I'm meant to be going. I don't know where this key is. I reported 380 odd bugs for Scavenger Studios in just under three months. And many of them were many of them were bugs that the actual QE team never caught, so it's very upsetting that I was never properly hired on. But that's what you get when you volunteer your time. Never volunteer your time for free, because you just get the piss taken out of you. I can't leave that way, goddammit. Yeah, no, never volunteer. If it's for a charity or something, whatever. If it's for a company that can afford to pay you, get paid. Don't do it for free. Oh, fuck. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Email shit at the studio. I'm pretty sure the, um, the, what are they called? Not the director. Maybe it is the director. Uh, got fired because of sexual misconduct. So, <laughs> it's under new management now. Which is why I still support them, because they have one of my favorite developers of all time working there. the key in here? Um, yeah, no, if you ever see someone called Scav David looking for 
Well, I guess I wouldn't be scab anymore. Looking for a job in development, he comes very highly recommended by me because he's just an awesome guy. One of my favorite developers. <clears throat> Anyone know where this key is? What's the key to? The elevator. Maybe it's in here. I don't think I've been in here yet. Oh, I can't fall back! Really? God damn it! You really want to know? Uh, I think I've just figured out what room it's in. Not that one. Shit. It's not on his ass. We did check that. Where the hell was that room? Making progress now? It's hard to tell. Wait, no, I'm just back here. Where's the key? Wait, no, this is a different place. This place is empty. Um. Okay, let's have a look over here then. Maybe in here? No? Uh... Oh. oh! Oh! Found it! Found a key! <laughs> Sorry! Sorry! He scared the shit out of me there. Oh, gods. I bet that smells awful.
music is not calming my nerves. Oh, I went the wrong way. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> ah! I went the wrong way! I'm back here! I just went in a big circle! I suck at directions, dude. Last time I went right, so let's go left this time. I just realized there's a big old sign there that tells me where the elevators are. <laughs> I was such an idiot. I'm dead. I'm dead! You open your door! You open your door! Ah! <laughs> no! Oh no! You can't see me. You can't see me. Really? <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> Alright then! <laughs> he couldn't see me! And that, ladies and gentlemen, is called being... A stealth master. <laughs> <sighs> that area sucks. I did not like. No 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 no! Whoa 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 whoa! Oh 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 oh! <sighs> um huh I think I I I I I <laughs> I think that's a good stopping spot there. Goodbye, YouTube. Don't forget to watch me on Twitch.tv for such a crazy PMGMD.